How do you measure poverty? The SWS conducts a survey. survey shows where in it nine in ten Filipinos approved of both President Duterte's country. Pagasa warns that by Thursday evening, the western section of the Philippines Maybe, uh, will be back. Things normalize, which means uh, unemployment uh, being at about five percent. What would it be like without data and statistics? There would be no information on natural calamities such as typhoons, volcanic activities, and earthquakes, which cause economic damages and casualties. There would be no information on diseases, what causes them, and how we can prevent them. Our lawmakers would have difficulty in creating policies and measures that catered to the needs of its citizens. We would not know the performance of our country and would not have any idea on how to move forward to further the country's development. The Department of Foreign Affairs recognizes the value of data and statistics in its diplomatic, consular, and assistance to national services. Despite the pandemic, the DFA continues to issue passports. From January to September of this year, there are a total of 1,319,917 passports issued. The DFA provides figures of COVID-19 infected Filipinos abroad. As of October 11, there are 10,869 confirmed cases 6,919 recoveries and 801 deaths. On repatriation efforts, as of October 11, the DFA has brought home a total of 213,942 overseas Filipinos from all over the world since February. The DFA, together with its foreign service posts, continues its efforts in ensuring the safety of Filipinos abroad amid the pandemic. Moreover, the DFA continues to provide posts with updated Philippine data and information relevant to achieving the country's economic objectives. This National Statistics Month, the DFA supports initiatives to increase awareness on statistics and promote accessibility to timely, reliable, and quality statistics for an evidence-based and efficient decision-making. In celebration of the third World Statistics Day, together we must connect the world with data we can trust.